Hello, once again, welcome back to my channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time. And don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In today's lesson, we're going to learn how we can convert a handwriting to text. So basically what you can see is a handwriting document and we're going to convert this to text for free. But before that, thank you so much for being part of the family. We have hit 3000 subscribers on YouTube. I really want to use this opportunity to thank you for being part of this family. So without much ado, let's jump right into action. So if you have Gmail account, you should be able to do this. We are going to use Google Documents and this is my Gmail account. Or you can just log onto your browser, Chrome browser. And then once you have your email logged on, you should be able to have the Google apps over here. So you have the app, just click on the apps and we are going to click on Google Drives. So go to Google Drive, you open that. So when you open Google Drive, click on the plus icon. That's where we have the new. Click on new and go to what? File upload. You want to upload the handwriting document. The file from wherever you have it on your computer. In this case, I have it in my pictures. So let me just look for that file. So there's the file, the handwriting document. I'll just open this. And I'll wait for it to upload onto my drive. So the upload is successful. So let's try to locate that file. From so after uploading the file to your drive, just and just locate that file and then right click and go to open. And then select Google document. That's Google Doc. Just click on that. Okay, so we've been able to open this particular handwriting document and Google document through our Google Drive. So this is the image and it will go ahead and extract the content for us. So if you can read this handwriting document, what we have as part of our handwriting document has been extracted. So you can have the full text document over here and you can copy. If you want to use it in any Word document, you can go ahead and do that. So when you Select everything and then you go to copy. You can go ahead and then copy it anywhere, paste it anywhere at all you want. So if I copy this, I can paste it into what? Microsoft Word or even using Notepad. So I can paste this right here. So you can see I've been able to copy the content of that document. If it's Word and you want to go ahead and, and do some further editing to that, you can go ahead and do that. So you can open this, you can try this for yourself and it didn't have a writing document at all. You've been able to use this process to extract the content from. 